The question says a particle of mass 1 kg is projected with an initial velocity 10 meter per second at an angle of projection 45 degree with the horizontal. The average torque acting on the particle on the projectile between the time at which it is projected and the time at which it strikes the ground about the point of projection in Newton meter s which means we have the surface a body is projected and definitely covering the parabolic path it reaches a point we can say if the speed is u over here definitely the speed is same u over here because the speed with which it is projected it's the same speed with which it is landing unless there is an air resistance considered over here we can say if this is theta this is also going to be theta so if we resolve the velocities we are going to get this as u cos theta and vertically downward as u sin theta over here it will be u cos theta horizontal and the vertical component is going to be u sin theta now we want the average torque about this point so we can say by definition torque is rate of change of momentum rate of change of I should say angular momentum about this point the angular momentum of the particle is going to be zero so I can say the initial angular momentum is zero which means this is nothing but L final upon the total time taken for it now we know L final is going to be MVR and the time taken is T and we need to understand the value of these things first of all velocity if you take u cos theta you can say it is along the line of the point which means the u cos theta have zero perpendicular distance from the point of projection which means we have to just take u sin theta into consideration so velocity becomes u sin theta the r which is the distance over here now that's nothing but the horizontal range for which the formula is u square sin 2 theta by g upon the time t is nothing but the total time of flight over here for which the formula is 2u sin theta by g now for the cancellation concerned this u sin theta gets cancelled this g gets cancelled now since theta is 45 sin 2 times 45 that is sin 90 is 1 so basically substituting m as 1 u given as 10 so square will be 100 sin 90 as 1 upon 2 the final answer is going to be 15 newton meter 